Joe, it's hurricane season. I need you and QAC TV to make a video about Know Your Zone. Yes, maybe we'll call it. Sure, whatever. All right, I'll go talk to him now. And, and Haas, did you ever notice that people don't say goodbye in the movies and stuff when they're talking on the phone? Yes, I have. Huh, must have lost connection or something. That's weird. Hey guys, the Queen Anne's County Department of Emergency Services is updating our 2020 plans to incorporate the hurricane season in COVID-19. And we need to get the information out about Know Your Zone and what to do for, to prepare for a hurricane. Can we help you with something, Joe? Well, I need to make a video about Know Your Zone and hurricane season and COVID-19. Cameras. I'll get Chris to do the, uh, the lights. We all need to take a closer look at our hurricane preparedness because of COVID-19. It's more important now than ever for families to make sure they have their family emergency plans, communication plans, and they have their needed supplies for a hurricane or COVID. Queen Anne's County has been working with local, state, and federal partners to ensure that our all-natural hazards planning incorporates COVID-19. We're looking at shelters that have less open space and more individual rooms to accommodate for social distancing practices. People need to know that it's important to allow extra time for evacuation in case they can't get to their shelter because it might be farther away due to COVID-19. Now it's possible for people to look into other options like sheltering with a family member or sheltering somebody outside of the danger zone. That way they don't have to worry about going to a shelter, but they should prepare and allow extra time. Now state, local, and federal partners will still be setting up shelters, but we would prefer that if possible, individuals seek shelter somewhere else. We also need to understand that people may have some psychological stress added due to the COVID-19 crisis and pandemic. And we need to know that there are things people can do, like preparing in advance for hurricane season and COVID-19. That way that stress is no longer on their plate. Right. Can you put this on? It's important for people to update their disaster supply kit to accommodate for the changes with COVID-19 and hurricane season. They should include hand sanitizer and masks for everyone in their evacuation groups. Prior to a hurricane, they should be monitoring official sources like weather.gov to look for any impending weather in the mid-Atlantic region to make sure that they're prepared ahead of time if a hurricane should strike. Yeah. See the mark? Hit that mark, Joe. People should check out Know Your Zone to see if the places that they live, work, and play here in Queen Anne's County are within an evacuation zone. Know Your Zone allows emergency officials to issue evacuation orders by zones A, B, and C. Hey Joe! So if folks wanted to know more about the Know Your Zone program or to see if they're in an evacuation zone, where should they go? They can go to QACDES.org and click on the Know Your Zone logo. Joe, it looks like we're all set. Okay. We also have to remember to mention that the zones are important, but even if you're not in one of the evacuation zones, you could still feel the effects of hurricanes and other hazards. Hurricanes can spawn flash floods, severe thunderstorms, and tornadoes many miles away from the eye of the storm and even 100 miles or more inland. There are some additional considerations while planning for hurricanes and other hazards during the COVID-19 pandemic. If you must evacuate, bring items such as hand sanitizer, cleaning materials, and two cloth face coverings per person. Children under two years of age or people who have trouble breathing and people who cannot take the cloth face covering off without help should not wear cloth face coverings. Pay attention to emergency information and alerts. Determine your best protection for high winds and flooding. Keep in mind that your best protection from the effects of a hurricane may differ from your best protection from diseases. Unless you live in an evacuation zone, make a plan to shelter in place in your home if it is safe to do so. If you live in a mandatory evacuation zone, make a plan with friends or family to shelter with them where you will be safer and more comfortable. Check with local authorities for the latest information about public evacuation shelters. Be sure to only use outdoor generators that are within at least 20 feet of your home and away from windows, doors, and vents. Make sure you do not walk, swim, or drive through any floodwaters. For more information about hurricane preparedness, please visit qacdes.org and go to the Emergency Management tab. You can also visit the Maryland Emergency Management Agency at mema.maryland.gov or the Federal Emergency Management Agency at ready.gov and also check out the National Weather Service at weather.gov. 
to receive alerts, tips, and resources related to COVID-19 and other threats and hazards here in Queen Anne's County, be sure to check out QACCitizenAlert.com and sign up for notifications specific to Queen Anne's County. And cut. All right, good job, Joe. Thanks. Oh, and Bruce, don't forget to mention our social media. Follow the Department of Emergency Services on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Yeah. We'll find a way to get that in there. For accurate and up-to-date information on Queen Anne's County, follow our official social media sites.